The new season is upon the Metro State women's basketball team, but last season is still in the minds of those who played in the first round of the RMAC tournament playoffs. It, it eats at us, and every day we, we still talk about it to this day. And we... Holding a one-point lead with only nine seconds to go, a controversial late foul call sent CSU Pueblo's Michelle Ambule to the free throw line. She drained both, and Metro never recovered in losing 57 to 54, ending their season. I think our returners will use that as motivation. We don't want to be in the same position this year as we were last year, you know, as a five seed going into the home floor of a, of a four, number four seed. Oh, we definitely use it for motivation. I mean, it was a tough loss. We were down by, I don't know, like 20 at 10 and a half, and we came, we came out strong. And I mean, it was our game. But uh, we fought hard to the end and just one lucky shot. Only one senior departs from the team as three new seniors will step up to lead both on and off the court. You know, Ray Bean is a four-year player for us. Uh, Chelsea Williamson has been here now three years. And, um, and Leander Sands, this is her second year in the program. They all know what my expectations are. They all, all know what it's like to go through an RMAC conference season. Metro senior forward Ray Bean earned all conference honors last season, averaging almost 13 points and six rebounds per game. Her knowledge of the game and the conference will filter down to the new freshman and junior college transfers. Freshman forward Jalisa Caesar will reap the most benefits, having to battle with Bean every day in practice. Ray is definitely, she's a huge motivator for me. Um, she she has a lot of advice to give me and she's really unselfish like um, it helps me a lot on the court like whenever she, I'm scared or something or nervous because obviously I am a freshman uh, she'll talk she'll talk to me and it really helps me but the freshman from Sioux City Iowa says the college game is still miles apart from the high school level it's definitely been a, a lot tougher um, obviously college ball is a lot more different everyone's a lot stronger um, but she definitely puts us through a lot of things that gets us um, to the in the necessary shape to compete at that level. While the experience from the returners will be huge in a return to the conference playoffs, the new blood will bring new energy. Uh, youth is always a good thing. Uh, obviously it can be bad at times, but I, I think they're ready to go. They have they all have great demeanors. You know, they aren't going to be ones that, um, you know, get too much confidence in any way. While a playoff loss can be devastating, the 2009-2010 Roadrunner squad are ready to push forward to reach even greater heights. It's going to be a fun season. You know, we have a lot of talent, and we just need to put our talent to work. And hopefully, the three of us seniors, we can just you know lead on the court and be good leaders and do what we got to do and bring what we learned from last year onto the court this year. For Metro State, I'm Eric Lansing.